Hi guys, another question of prelims 2022 that is fully solvable through previous year questions is given on the right part of your screen under the column headed prelims 2022 question. So this question gave you three statements. These statements represented powers of Lok Sabha and the question wants you to identify which of these three are exclusive to the Lok Sabha. The Rajya Sabha does not have these powers. Okay, so I'm not reading the full question right now come directly to the second statement it says to pass a motion of no confidence against the council of ministers is an exclusive power of lok sabha yes or no okay come to the respective pyq it was asked in the year 2014 the question read consider the following statements regarding a no confidence motion in india come directly to the second statement it says a motion of no confidence can be introduced in the lok sabha only and not in the Rajya Sabha. In this question, you were required to identify the correct statements. There were two statements. The answer is Charlie. Charlie is both one and two. So the second statement is correct. The first statement is not of our concern. Uh, it is not asked in the 2022 question, but overall the topic of no confidence is important. So of course you have to go through all of these points. So the second statement is correct. It says a motion of no confidence can be introduced only in the Lok Sabha. This means that the second statement of 2022 question is correct. If the second statement of 2022 is correct, we come to the options. We eliminate Charlie and Delta because these do not have the second statement. That means only the first uh, alpha option and second Bravo option can uh, either of these is the answer. Now we just need to worry about the first statement. We just need to study the first statement and see uh, whether it is correct or not. Okay. so. Let us come to the first statement now. It says, to ratify the declaration of emergency is an exclusive power of Lok Sabha. Okay. Come to the respective PYQ. It was asked in the year 2006. Consider the following statements. Come directly to the second statement. It says, resolution approving the proclamation of emergency are passed only by the Lok Sabha. Okay. The answer is alpha. Alpha is one only. In this question, you were required to identify the correct statement. That means only the first statement is correct. The second statement is incorrect. This means that only Lok Sabha will not pass the resolution for emergency. Rajya Sabha also does that. This means the first statement of 2022 question is incorrect. And this means that alpha option is incorrect. Thus, the answer to the 2022 question is bravo, that is two only. So you can see that just by two statements, we have already arrived at the answer. So we don't need to worry about the third statement, but we have a PYQ which talks about the third statement as well. So let us come to this one. The third statement says to impeach the president of India is an exclusive power of Lok Sabha. Okay, this PYQ was asked in the year 1996. It says, which one of the following is part of the electoral college for the election of the president of India, but does not, uh, does not form a part of the forum for his impeachment. So basically, which one of these four is a part uh, in the election, but is not a part during the impeachment? The answer is Delta. That means state legislative assemblies. Look at the alpha option Lok Sabha. So Lok Sabha, according to the question, it means that Lok Sabha is a part of both the uh, election as well as impeachment and the Bravo option says Rajya Sabha. Similarly, Rajya Sabha also is a part of both election as well as impeachment. This means that the third statement that to impeach the president of India is an exclusive power of Lok Sabha is an erroneous statement. It is a wrong statement. So guys, this whole uh, question, this question contained uh, multiple aspects. It was talking about emergency. It was talking about, you know, uh, no confidence motion. It was talking about impeachment of president, uh, powers of Lok Sabha, powers of Rajya Sabha. So multiple dimensions were there to this question. And overall, there are more than 15 questions in the PYQs which are directly or indirectly related to these aspects. I've collected all of the 15 questions in the PDF. Of course, the PDF is uh, purchasable at rupees 99 if you wish to do that. Thank you for joining me today. See you next time.